The thorax shows a combination of bony and soft tissue landmarks. An understanding of these landmarks helps to externally delineate the intrathoracic organs. The breast is a prominent landmark in the adult female. The nipple and areola are seen at its summit anteriorly. The breast in males and in the pediatric age group is rudimentary, but the nipple and the areola are well seen. Thoracic cage The thoracic cage is an osteocartilaginous barrel that encloses vital organs like the lungs and the heart, as well as protects some of the upper abdominal viscera. It is truncated above, but expands below and provides attachment to the diaphragm muscle. It is formed by the sternum, 12 pairs of ribs and their costal cartilages, and 12 thoracic vertebrae with their intervertebral discs at the back. The female breasts are large glandular structures in the superficial fascia of the anterior chest wall. In the adult female, they appear as large, rounded eminences on either side of the chest. However, the shape and size of the breasts vary among females, and in the same female, during various periods like puberty, pregnancy, lactation, and old age. The thorax consists of the thoracic wall and an enclosed thoracic cavity. The thoracic wall is formed by the bony thoracic cage with its attached muscles and separated from the abdomen below by the diaphragm. Within the thoracic cavity are vital structures. These include the heart, lungs, and major blood vessels like the pulmonary trunk, thoracic aorta, and superior and inferior vena cava. The superior mediastinum is the upper part of the thoracic cavity. It extends from the thoracic inlet above to the plane connecting the sternal angle and T4, T5 disc. The mediastinal pleura forms its lateral boundary. The superior mediastinum contains several important structures. The trachea and esophagus pass vertically down into the superior mediastinum. The thymus extends from the neck and the anterior part. The inferior mediastinum is divided into three parts by the pericardium, the anterior, middle, and posterior parts. The posterior mediastinum is located right in front of the vertebral column, T5 to T12. It is limited above by the plane that passes through the sternal angle and T4, T5 disc. Below, it is separated from the abdomen by the diaphragm. Anteriorly, it is limited by the bifurcation of the trachea, pulmonary vessels, pericardium, and part of the diaphragm. It is bordered laterally by the mediastinal pleura.